On his deathbed almost nine years ago, Alexander Litvinenko had been tricked into drinking tea laced with the radioactive poison polonium. 22 days later, the former KGB agent was dead. These are the prime suspects, Dmitry Kovtun and Andrei Lugovoy, but they are in Moscow and have no intention of returning to the UK. Today, the barrister for the Metropolitan Police said their denials are hollow and he hinted at collusion at the highest level. No matter how many state honours Putin may pin to Lugovoy's chest for services to the motherland, However meteoric Lugovoy's rise in politics has been and may become, Lugovoy and Cobton have no credible answer to the scientific evidence. The level of radiation has been described at the inquiry as a nuclear attack on the streets of London. The final poisoning took place in this Mayfair hotel, where Covton and Lugovoy are accused of pouring polonium into a teapot as they waited for Alexander Litvinenko. Those few sips of what he thought was ordinary green tea had sealed his fate. For Alexander Litvinenko, it was a slow and agonizing death. And the inquiry heard that days later, on his deathbed, he was angry, angry with himself that he'd let down his guard, that one mistake was all it had taken. Dmitry Kovtun has only been to the UK twice. He says it's a coincidence that major polonium contaminations happened on those dates. There is bad luck and appalling bad luck. But that is off the scale if Cobton is an innocent man. It's been put to the inquiry that this is not a who done it, but a how did they do it. As far as the Litvinenko family are concerned, it's the next best thing to a criminal trial. Simon Viger, 5 News.